you see all the cor cars going in one direction, right? Yeah. Are you at the where the beginning of the cars or the end of the car? Like where people are exiting out? Yeah, which one's the end? Like I said, the last sign, you'll see that one says like South Florida. Hey! A quick evolving beginning stage of Dr. B Collections. And right now, our, our process within this journey is our samples. Yeah. Yep, yep. Yeah. 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 Now I want to see the samples. Hey. Hey. I'm kind of scared. Sided versus the one single sided. Okay. So, this will kind of give us the aesthetic and the feel for how we're going to move forward with other pieces with silk. So, it's good that we did a double sided, we did a single side on both the, the first prototype, this is the second one. This is the double. The double, that's a single, but we did do the double because we oh, might wow. do yeah. the double on a few other pieces. We are in the process of making more design samples while ordering our finalized product for our current samples. Oh my god. Hey guys. Is it greasy face resistance? Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Yes, we'll be able to wear these several different ways, so I think that that's something we're going to talk about too for the marketing and brand promotion for them. Part of our other Dr. B team is DeNovo. DeNovo is our marketing director. He has been in the hip hop game for a minute. He has been involved with a lot of well known hip hop and RB artists um, for the last 15 years. So he knows a lot of people in that industry. And as we were strategizing, he was like, hey, you know, it'll be, it'll change the game. It'll be really dope if Dr. B had its own jingle. And he was like, you know, all these fast food franchises and other um, companies have a jingle. Like, why don't you have a jingle? Like, it'll change the game for Dr. B collections and it'll separate yourself from a lot of people that, hey, you're in your own lane as um, an up and coming fashion line. So he recommended, let's do a jingle and let's have a person who is well known sing the jingle. Now that this is what it's about, the beginning stages. And then later on, we're gonna come back to this and you'll be like, damn, man, we were just meeting about that, talking about this, and then you're on to bigger and better. And it's like, damn, we we can't stop. We're pumping them out, and that's what, that's what it is. But this is what it's about. This is the beginning to, the, to it all, you know what I'm saying? Everybody has to start something. Mm -hmm. Back to B. Back to B, the logo. I love the way it happened, too. Sure. It went through, like, how many versions? Yeah. And we just were like, nah, this is cool, but it don't hit right. And I was just like, you know what, you know what it's going to be? And I, and I remember, I was like, remember that old school April Walker wear? You know, because back in the day, like, the female uh, 
she didn't want to let it be known that it was the brand was run by a female, right? Because it was like a male dominant, and she like, did that. She had that sick like, April Walker wear that Tupac was rocking in the, in, in the above the rim. And I was like, yo, Dr. B. She said, damn. Yeah. 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 you know? Uh -huh. And I was like, that's it! Look! And she was like, this is it! You know, but I, then, I, then I vectorized it and made it all, you know, just cutty, clean. Yeah. No, it's really dope to see it all come to life from the design, from the from the Vegas trip to conceptualizing it, to designing it, to now the finished product. She actually designed the inner part. Oh. The bell flower, you know, all the medicines found, you know, from our land, you know, down to the cedar and everything. We posted a clip today about this uh, artist named Norval, and he was talking about, you know, back in the day, you can um, have these like paraphernalia, put it in, you know, medicine pouch. Here you go, it's an amulet to heal, right? And it's like, and he just took those same things, those same symbols, and turned them into icons and put it in the painting, just like the scarf there. And that becomes the medicine. So when I'm thinking about Dr. B and, and you know, everything we're talking about, Deep res, you know, the way we grew up, it's like they, these are what we're normally seeing out there. Um, especially, you know, I mean, the, the, those, that, that's, you know, that cedar right there, you know, like, and then we incorporate that into the design. You know, the new classic, that's, right. that's how I look at you, you know? It's still, you still contain that original uh, sage wisdom of our elders, but we just updated it, you know? This is gonna go back to help people. Mm -hmm. Yep. Like, when we sell these, Straight up, it's going back to help people. Like, you know, you know, you do the same thing with yep. your brand. Mm -hmm. You get back into nonprofits yeah, too. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Into our grassroots communities. Right. It's all about going back to remember and never forgetting who we are mm -hmm. and, you know, coming full circle to give back to our communities and to always be supportive in that initiative. color palettes, the hues, the aesthetics, the fabrics, the sharing of the stories, and the deeper meaning and the connection of the web of life of bringing this all together as this team. So I'm honored and it's a blessing to be able to work with you guys. So I look forward to what's going to come. So we are still in the process of our corn grind. <laughs> and I say, instead of saying grind, I'm going to indigenize it and say we are still in the process of this corn grind and so please continue to follow us on this exciting uh, journey with Dr. B Collections. Dr. B.